All right, so we're adopting a new dog, and this I wanted to try. It is a GPS tracking collar, and I was looking for different types, ones that didn't have monthly expenses. This one does, but for what they give you, I hope it's worth it. I'm going to try it, um, and I just kind of give you an idea. So here's a medium-sized collar we got at PetSmart. You can see that. Um, so size-wise, it's, it's comparable. This one's kind of cool. It's kind of a obviously a bit beefier so here it says lift clearly lift okay cool so it gives you the uh, app instructions things there and this must be the charging pod i'm assuming yes charger supposedly lasts approximately 20 days uh, depending on what the situation is i think too like you can set it to say hey where's my dog's lost and then it, it uses more power because it's giving you more real-time pings um there's the little cute little plug fairly long cable that's kind of nice I think it plugs into that guy and then here's the collar itself wow that is nice for the price, it's really, uh, you do get some good quality. Yeah, that's like a metal clasp. That's metal. Metal, and there's the tracker. So, let's get that app downloaded and give this thing a whirl. Oh, by the way, we don't have the, we're picking up the dog today. So, if you look around, we just have the Chihuahua, wherever she is, Lily. And Lily has no idea. It's one thing you can't explain to dogs what's happening is unfortunate can't have a conversation with them anywho uh yeah this is super exciting let's see how this works this is really cool it's charging on the pod now so i have it plugged in and there's the uh kind of the base station unit but that's it uh very sturdy metal clasp very sturdy um so that's really cool and i love the design also They've done a nice job here. So let's see how it actually functions. Okay, now you can see it's fully charged. You get a solid blue light. So not only was I impressed by the hardware of the collar, but the software is really well done too. After you download it from Android or Apple, my version was Android, you'll key in your email address, phone number, they'll send you an SMS message, you key in the confirmation code, and then you're off to the races. You start keying in the details of your dog. Now, our new dog is called River. And uh, then you key in the other details and information, the uh, birth date or the adoption date. Then lastly, key in the weight, and then you'll add the collar. All right, so now we're gonna install it. Here's the clip, <laughs> she's ready to go. And then we're gonna cl click this in, you'll see how well it connects. Let's get a close up of how well it connects. There we go. No fur. You're good to go, River. What do you say, huh? Now let's adventure. So you can see it when you go into the app, it initially defaults to the live section and up above is listed our dog river. Then you have the discover social media, the ranking, the activity of your dog and your primary dog's data attributes. Let's go and look into the mapping, the live area. You can see where the dog is. And if you click on the icon, it shows you the battery percentage, your dog's names with Kobe, because it's connected to my 
phone, if also, if you will, it, it's I'm within the vicinity and then it's connected to the base station. That icon there just onto the lower right shows it's connected via the base station and not cellular data. That's your big savings right there. And that's where it could help to have multiple base stations, which you can do. Now, if you have a big backyard and it's dark, you can click here and activate the LED light that flashes that beacon, uh, which is really cool. It's actually quite bright at night. Uh, and then you can just disable it. It will time out eventually to save battery, uh, but that actually works quite well. Fi Discover is Fi's social media page for your pet and other pets where you can interact, like photos, et cetera. And it is specific to them. It's kind of cool. You also can link this uh, up with your social media for like Instagram. Next, you can see the ranking of your dog. And this is across all dogs or just your specific breed, uh, your specific city and or your specific state. It's actually kind of fun how many steps your dog gets, how many walks you do. All of that kind of ranking system uh, helps your dog rise in the ranking. So kind of fun. And in the next section of the app, you get to track the actual activity. You can see the live data, the daily, the weekly, the monthly, all that information is logged on this screen. Then you have your nightly. You can check the activity at night, sleeping, resting, all that information and the duration. And it's actually really nice to know. Uh, gives you a lot more data than just if your dog gets lost. Then lastly, this is the information all about your dog. The pictures that you've taken and shared and also the specifics about the weight, the date, the breed, all that information all right here. And lastly, here's the main menu where you can add additional callers, define your safe zones, Wi-Fi networks, base stations. You can have multiples, like I said, that helps with battery life. The owners, you can get to how many owners and you can share the app with them. You can see where they walk, notifications, account settings, system diagnostics. Uh, that's kind of cool where you can make sure that um, the Wi-Fi and also the GPS and the LTE connectivity work help center where you can open tickets if you have issues. Uh, you can also share the FI app itself and sign out. It's very comprehensive. And we've had the collar on her for over a month and she's not complaining about it. Now we've taken River on this walk to demonstrate loss mode. Here you can see that yellow line, which perfectly shows where we've walked her so far. Now let's push on the activate loss mode. There you go, that kicks it in. And from here, this is what will chew up most of the battery life. This is again, something temporary when the dog is lost. And at night, this is actually fairly bright, but yeah, it does flash red when your dog is lost. She's coming at me, so it's a little harder to see, but it's easier on the side. So definitely at night, if you're trying to find her, try to zoom in here. You can see it there. Step back. There, see? One, two, three, one, two, it's like an SOS. That's cool. So she's, thank goodness, not lost, but that works really well. And after the 30 day free trial, if you don't like it, you can send it back. But here I went ahead and did it. And this is the receipt. It's $99 or $8.25 a month. Considering what they give you and the value they bring, I actually love it. And it's that peace of mind that if your dog gets lost or breaks out of that safe zone, that in fact, you're going to be able to track them down. If you are considering getting a tracking collar for your pet, this one's really nice. It's not an overly large one. And again, because they use that base station kind of technology, if you will, um, it, it really helps conserve battery life. I'm actually getting a second base station. Um, if you're interested, I will leave the referral code. Um, I'll put it on the screen, but I'll also put it in the notes here so that if you uh, use that, you'll actually get a free collar in addition. So uh, good stuff all the way around. Um, so give it a shot. They also have a 30-day trial that you can do.
and uh, see what you think. Anyway, I hope you like this video. Remember, considering subscribing, it really does help. And uh, I appreciate your time today and uh, take care. We'll see you. Bye.